goes, what are you doing in the living room? You are dead. Hey, hey, I'm going to do something that is very out of character for me. I'm making a tutorial for a game. I thought if I change it up to my normal 2D and 3D tutorials. So I'm going to do gameplay where I explain several things if you want to start playing Phasmophobia. Phasmophobia is a game where you are a paranormal detective and need to find out one where in the building does the ghost reside and to what type of ghost is it out of the 21 possibilities. This is done by collecting evidence and if you have found three clues you can determine the type of ghost you are dealing with. There are optional challenges available to earn additional in-game money to buy more equipment to aid you in your quest. You need to solve the contract while the ghost is breathing down your neck and you try to stay alive. Are you ready for this? Here we go! Now we see here in the truck the optional objectives. Uh, first off, discover what type of ghost we are dealing with. And then we can get a ghost to walk through salt and have a member of your team witness a ghost event. Detect the ghost presence with a motion sensor. Now uh, we're going to uh, practice in Willow Street House and you see on that little green icon uh, the circuit breaker is in the garage so the first thing I need to do because I'm playing this on intermediate is to turn on the power source and that is very important to get the heating up in the house to be able to um, run, use the thermometer in all the rooms to locate the ghost room. And um, it's also very important to put all uh, uh, the lighting uh, uh, on uh, because uh, when you are too long in the door, dark your sanity will drain and most ghosts start hunting with 50% uh, sanity but there are some exceptions uh, some ghosts uh, hunt with 100% sanity like the demon uh, some uh, with 60% sanity like Onryo uh, uh, 65 Raju and 80% yokai uh, while talking. So, um, <laughs> if you have the the suspicion you have a yokai, just stop talking. <laughs> stop talking. So I I surely hope I don't have a yokai for this tutorial because I need to talk a lot. Uh, you pick up the key. Normally, I already took that one and I also did some prep work I put all my video cameras on the tripods already I like to do that before the counter starts and uh, the counter starts not when you are opening door like this but the counter starts to count down um, the moment you are entering the front door keep that in mind so we just we we gonna do uh, a gameplay and i'm gonna explain things as i go so i take a torch i uh, set it on with the primary function i press t so that whichever equipment I have in my hand, I still have uh, light. 
I take a camera always with me on the first time I go into the house and I take a thermometer to determine the temperature and that is the reason why I need to go uh, as soon as I can to the garage where the breaker is in. So I have a, te a thermometer in my hand, I have my torch and I have a camera. And just a walk with me. <laughs> this is my favorite house, Willow Street. Uh, the training house is uh, Tanglewood. I also always do uh, the light switch uh, on because when I get the breaker sorted out the lights will automatically go on where I click the switch so you can see that here the lights are on right there now I need to the the heating always takes a couple of minutes uh, to have a contrast in the in the temperature between the rooms so that you really can determine uh, if it's below zero, zero degrees because you need to find the ghost room or ghost area that is below zero degrees and what we do now is uh, basically uh, turn on the lights everywhere and look for the bone uh, the bone is a money maker oh we found a cursed object uh, these are tarot cards if you find the cursed objects uh, object you need to take a picture of it with primary use and then I go continue to look for the bone and, uh, I think it, it takes a maximum of three minutes to for the house to really warm up properly and then you uh, have that uh, knowledge. So we going to. Oh, there is the bone. Okay. We found the bone. We crouch with C, toggle to our camera. Uh, oh, if you make a picture. Of something on the ground always crouch the the picture you get of it is then immediately three star picture and uh, curse objects also give it three star picture if you do a close-up shot you pick up the bone with E regardless of how many objects you have in your hand that doesn't matter and we switch back to the thermometer it's um, no it's not below 10 degrees so no indication that this is actually the ghost room here it's nice and toasty oh 17 degree okay, not that toasty but oh 20 yeah no this is not a ghost room we are looking for a chilly place Wanna run in the garage real quick utility too hot as well Well, and this is the living. Oh, we have 
the ghost in the living room we have negative degrees and you can also see them on my bread um, there sometimes there will be like white clouds uh, on the bottom of the screen and um, so this is the ghost room and when I located the ghost room I drop all my equipment here when I found the bone I drop my camera here too uh, I personally find that really peculiar that I find the ghost in the living room ghost what are you doing in the living room you are dead so uh, we just um, well we go to get some equipment we go back at the truck and we need to check our sanity real quick sanity 85 that's fine I take in an EMF reader I uh, with an empty hand so an empty slot because you can take three things in your hand I pick up a tripod at the base uh, not at the video cam itself but at the upper part of the tripod and then I walk outside the video camera uh, falls open and then you use your primary function to um, activate your video camera and then you can put that video camera you point it where you want it and then you drop it with G like that and then I'm gonna do a quick round around the living room with the EMF reader no luck just yet oh we have our little lady made a mess already I'm going to put that um, EMF reader down as well and then I'm gonna run for more equipment sanity real quick that's fine we take the book we take we toggle to an empty slot we pick up the tripod we do the primary use and we run until the ghost room never run in the ghost room that might not end well <laughs> and we position this camera as well and then I'm going to drop the book I crouch so that you have on the floor and then I press F to activate it ghost draw something for me draw something pretty how's our sanity doing it's fine it's fine we take the dots projector which uh, lets you view see through images of the <laughs> of the ghost you take one more camera the last camera and then um, 
we bring it in the living room as well. Where shall I put that? Shall I put that over here? Pointing there. Yes, take so. And then I toggle to the DOS projector. I kneel and I position it on the floor. Then we run to the truck again. And then we take and dots. And we take cruise fix for good measure. Have some fate. <laughs> and I need to take a quick look if the cameras are positioned properly. Oh yes, motion sensor. I need to play the motion sensor. Okay. Not facing the back of the couch. Not facing the front of the couch. Okay. I do not see any orbs or dots yet. But that might be because it's so light. Oh. Um, I'm gonna... Uh, I have plenty of pills. I just take a pill. Um, I need to take in the spirit box and a finger torch. Uh, UV <laughs> torch. And this walking talkie only works when the lights are off. So put it on with your primary function. Press the B key to talk to it. Are you close? Are you near? Are you happy? Do you want to talk? Talk to me. Draw me a picture in the book. No look so bad. Yeah. Drop that one on the floor. Oh, we have an EMF. How many lights do we have? One, two, three lights. That is not evidence. That is not evidence. So we need to check these doors for fingerprints as well. It might not be your finger goes, and then you won't see fingers, fingerprints, handprints, but you do not always get to see them, because 
the, the finger evidence, the fingerprint evidence is really tricky. Can be on uh, light switches as well and on doors, but so far no luck. I'm gonna drop it. Sanity real quick. Ooh. Oh, I forgot to kill the light. I forgot to kill the light. Uh, what shall we take in? Uh, oh, we can do a cross. Uh, what do I have in my hand? Cross and a salt. Okay. Never run in the ghost room. I'm going to put cross because it's right there with G, not with F, with G. And the salt can I put there. That's for a step, uh, the last step, the money making step. So, an additional camera. Evidence just yet, except for freezing. Oh, I forgot it. Oh, the god. Okay. Okay. Uh, the motion sensor I need. Yes, the motion <laughs> sensor I need. I just take two. I have two, so. How's my sanity? It's fine. It's a good practice to place a motion sensor uh, on the lower end of the wall because then uh, if it's a child ghost or a crawler then you have um, more success of catching it. So, place it here. And that was one of the objectives which can make you money. Oh, oh god, my god, this is the third time I, I forgot to count the lights. Uh, this, what I, this, this is what I get for playing solo. Normally you have your teammates to remind you to turn off the lights. And that was the motion sensor turning grey. That's excellent. That's excellent. And again. And you can here see where I placed the motion sensors. Those are those uh, red uh, stripes. And uh, every time the ghost walks, walks uh, uh, near it, then they turn green. And you hear a beep. Okay. Um, uh, what was I doing? Uh, oh yes, I 
wanted to check the cameras and uh, don't do your torch in the camera just make sure you turn your torch uh, off and also when you're playing in team do not shine your torch on the monitor when a team member is looking so I do not see any orbs that was the and see now they are green one is green um, and um, that is an indication that the ghost and again walked in front of the motion sensor but I do not see any orbs or any dots it still can be able to be the EMF 5 the spirit box the fingers the ghost writing that's quite of a bummer so I, I do not have dots or orbs which means it can be a wide range of evidences oh it can be a demon I'm not happy with a demon a demon can hunt at 100% sanity and a onryo if, if a flame goes out then an Onryo can hunt at 60% and the Uri drops the sanity really fast a good thing it's not a yokai so I can keep talking <laughs> now I have a lot of motion sensors here but no no luck just yet on the on the evidence front let's check some more evidence then oh we're going to make purple rain Let's get for fingerprints. No fingerprints here. Uh, I assume it's never on the outside of the front door. It's not logical <laughs> in my mind. But we can make. Ah, we have a fingerprint. Look, a hand. Yes, a hand. We have a hand. So what we do now, which uh, the last, uh, the the second on the left. Okay. What we do now, which uh, might be uh, really weird to do, but we're going to take a photo of the hand while we don't see it anymore and um, that actually works so I'm gonna take a picture and checking in the journal fingerprints three stars so that works even if you uh, do not see uh, the handprint anymore so I'm going, what did I have in my hand? Oh, I wanted to do a quick run of the 
EMF reader to see if we get oh that's lovely thank you thank you for the darkness yes Need to turn my light on again oh it's, it didn't kill the breaker it just hit the light switch so we can do that as well <laughs> Um, so when I walked here, it killed the light. Was that, was that a hint? Oh, oh, it turned on the TV. Uh, two light is that your favorite TV show, Ghost? Yes. Do you like uh, watching the Rainbow Channel? I think I'm gonna drop the EMF on the on the couch. And um do you mind me turning that TV on? Because that's not annoying at all. <laughs> and we're going to check our sanity. Seventy percent. Um, we have fingerprints. That means we cannot have um, fingerprints. Fingerprints. That means we cannot have uh, dots. You cannot have fingerprints and dots apparently at the same time so it can be still a demon <laughs> I hope it isn't a demon but but then if it is <coughs> you can see how I die uh, Jin, Hantu and the Mimic but with the Mimic I expect orbs as well the Mimic is a special new ghost it's the last uh, ghost they added and uh, the mimic has spirit box fingerprints and freezing but it also has orbs so I always uh, say the mimic has four evidences and not officially but unofficially it has four so what do we have a demon yes hunts at can hunt at 100 percent and a smudge only works uh, for 60 seconds and other ghost smudge works at 90. then we have the hand to uh we need to have the power on with the hand to um, we have a, an, an, a gin which is EMF level 5 fingerprints freezing and the mimic is spirit box so we I'm looking for EMF 5 uh, if it's a demon I have ghost writing if I go back and I do not have ghost writing, I do not think it's a demon. Uh, for a hand to, we need orbs. I didn't see that one. And for a mimic, we may need spirit box. So uh, let's. What's the sanity? Let's fill up. And we need to check ghost writing um, turn the light off again to see the potential orbs orbs you always need to check with that night vision never like this you can't see orbs like this you need to have the 
night vision active. I need to remember to turn off the light. I need to check the spirit box. And I'm going to do some smudging. And it already is. Oop, 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 oh, walking through the door. So classy. Ah, now I check the uh, spirit box. But where did I put that one? Oh, it's, it's, it's Oh, you can um, trigger motion sensors yourself too, obviously. So, uh, but that won't show up in the objective that the ghost did it. Are you close? Over here. Are you close? Are you near? Are you happy? Do you want to talk? Do you want to hurt us? Talk to me. What do you want? Well, it's not a real talkative ghost, I think. So I'm gonna drop that lighter here too. Oh, kill the lights, kill the lights. Oh, I did the lights. Excellent. <laughs> now, do we see anything? I didn't check for the ghost writing, did I? I didn't. Oh, forgot it again. Bring in, uh, bring in a lobby candle. Uh, that was the wrong button. If you want to light a candle, light the lighter and then press F with the candle in your primary hand. And then you can toggle. And you throw away that lighter, yes. I'm just I'm just going with that to have some make it a little bit romantic. But uh, with the lights on. Romantic with the lights on. Where is the where did I put the Yes, yes, yes. Three lights. Okay, that's not evidence. Um, oh yes, I have a candle. Position a candle with F. Secondary use. Then we position one here, just for fun. Um, and the ghost writing. No ghost writing. No artistic talent whatsoever. No. Okay. I didn't have a ghost effect yet. Nothing at all. Hmm. Okay. Uh, it, it's not ghost writing. It's not ghost writing. I don't believe in ghost writing at this point. So it's a hand to a gen or a mimic. Um, a gen needs EMF5. A hand to needs orbs. 
and the mimic needs the spirit box. The thing is with orbs, if they wear orbs, I would have seen them. I I would have seen them but now. It's it's not likely that you get orbs in the middle of your game. You get them as soon as you found the ghost room. So I'm gonna uh, like cross to the orbs as well. So then we have Jin or Mimic. Jim needs EMF 5. And then the Mimic needs the Spirit Box. But the, every time I had the Mimic, I also had orbs. So when I do the deduction, I think it's a Jin. I'm just gonna throw a lot of smudge sticks inside because oh no oh no I'm I'm, I'm gonna oh, I'm just gonna throw one on the on the floor that's always efficient I take that purple plate thing and then I have one smudge stick and a purple plate thing yes. I'm gonna do one more drop run. Hello, lady. Just dropping off some stuff. And I'm going to drop the smudge stick near the lighter for convenience. Seven more empty slots to fill our photo album. So what I'm gonna do? I have two. I I have two bottles left. What a luxury! That's I I'm just gonna drop everything in the in the room in case I need it real fast. Like this, gonna drop the pills. Okay, so now um, I'm gonna take my last pills. I'm gonna take a camera in my hand. I'm gonna do a purple plate thing. And then I'm gonna walk to the house and I'm going to activate with primary use the glow stick and so can with F, I distribute the salt cans and I'm gonna throw the empty can out of the way, toggle to my photo cam, and while I crouch and take a little distance, I wait for Carol to walk in the salt. Dear Carol, Will you walk in the salt with me? Not just lick it, you know. Yes, yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Do we have a... No oh my god, she does an entire cha-cha-cha. Oh, I was too... Too late for that one. Oh, 
she wants to watch TV. No, we're not going to watch TV. We're going to walk through the salt. Yes, we do the walk through the salt game now. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, another one. Another one. That's the... Oh my god. A lot. My camera is, is empty. I need to take another camera. Where did I... Where did I... <laughs> where did I put all the cameras? Oh, here. Here is one. Okay, that's only two. It's only two. Oh, here is one. Okay. Um. Um. I need to do. Uh, can I take? Can I take the pills already? Yes, I can. So I'm gonna use the other smut the other glow stick ah there is the glow stick okay okay drop that there I take this salt 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 show them away and then uh, can I take another camera? I do not run out. Miss Gavril, do the walking in the salt again. Dance a cha cha for me again. Uh, a thing that you never should do, and that is. Check the journal when while you are in the house. I can take two more pictures. I need two more footsteps, Carol. Miss Taylor. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, you come walk through this door. Okay. Enter. And walk through the salt. No luck. No luck. Oh, now she walks there. Oh. Carol Taylor. Walk to the soul for me. Or just show yourself so I can make a picture of you. Either... Yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Can we have one more? And I didn't have a ghost event yet either. And I think I needed that one. Do a ghost event. Hmm. She doesn't want to walk. Yes, she does. Thank you. I'm uh, gonna go now. Thank you for the lovely uh, evening. Now, let's see if Carol Taylor was actually a gym. Jim selected photos one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, not a perfect game. Only two. Uh, only two. Oh, I probably didn't crouch enough or something. Almost. Almost not good enough, but oh, my sanity dropped insanely. Um, 
let's close the door, shall we? And see if she was a gym or if she was a mimic after all. She could mimic a gym. <laughs> that is possible. It was a gym. Good, good. $150. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, thank you for watching and make it a great day!